This video is intended to lay out the various transition paths for those who have already earned previous Azure certifications. For those of you wanting more in-depth information about each individual certification, I've provided a link in the description below to Microsoft's website. If you have previously passed 7532 developing Microsoft Azure solutions, there is not a transition exam to get you to the Microsoft Certified Azure Developer. You will be required to take the AZ203 exam. If you have passed either 7533 or 7535, there is a transition path until the end of June 2019. If you have passed 7533, you can take the single AZ-102 exam to earn Microsoft Certified Azure Administrator. And if you have taken the 7535, you can take the AZ-302 exam to get Microsoft Certified Azure Solutions Architect. Now there's one more thing to point out about these. There were AZ-200, 201, and 202 beta exams. These exams have been retired and at the last check in early January, the grades for these have not yet been posted and the process or whether you've actually earned a certification from taking these beta exams is unclear. I suggest that you go to mcp.microsoft.com and check whether you were granted the certification based upon how you performed on these beta exams. I also want to point out that the 7532, the 533, and 535 exams have been retired. The certifications earned from these exams are currently valid, and there's not a stated retirement date for those certifications at this point. If you enjoyed this content, please like, comment, and subscribe, as we will be having even more Azure-related videos later this year on our YouTube channel. Looking for more in-depth information on the Azure certifications mentioned in this video, or want to see what Azure courses Linux Academy currently offers, please visit our blog via the link on this video. Thank you.